Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and bees color with me. So today in this video, I am going to be doing the end of the month pages for November. I didn't do too many. Like I said before in my other video, I didn't, I didn't, I gave like a list of stuff that I was going to do and I did say that I might not be able to do all of it since we had a holiday in November, Thanksgiving. So it was a lot to do. Anyway, so let's get started. All right, let me move all this here. And today's a rainy day. <laughs> all right, let's start with this. Let me start with this one. All right, so the first book here is 50 Autumn Mandalas by Kamalia and Jakova. I did one page. You probably saw it. And the, um, I meant to do more in this page. This one. This was a whip, and I have finished this one. I meant to do more in this page, so next month I might just do more and just do a couple pages in this book. I love the way this came out. I just used the um the Crayola board tip markers, the, the big markers, you know, the children's markers that I used that for, and it came out nice. So I'm loving those markers. So I gotta give me some super tips because <laughs> um the markers came out real nice you know what i'm saying um i had to i didn't have to worry about oh it bled through a little bit oh yes it did it did bleed through a little bit i'm surprised they bled through but it didn't bleed too much i just used did i use any um oh yeah i think i used gel pen i don't know if y'all can see it you see it? i used gel pen the glitter gel pen for that let me move this why is in the way okay um yeah, so that's the only page that I did in here. I suppose I do have got a couple of whips. I think I have a whip. Oh, this one here. So this is the whip. I gotta show you how I've colored this apple. I'll do it in another video, like a tutorial, and show you because this was this was with the castle art pencil. I'm surprised it came out like that. I shocked myself. Anyway. Yeah, so this came out nice. I wish I would have colored more in this book. But, um, hey, <laughs> time go by so fast. It's like, oh, all right. So I really, really love this picture here. And I meant to do the, um, the bingo thing for Feth. I'll probably do it next month and do just do two in that one month. So, okay, let me go. Let me go to this one here. Stress release book. You probably seen the little short for this. And I did a flip through of this book. So I did this here. I used the castle. I use all types of pencils. Pants. I used everything in that one. This here. So I don't know if you see the glitter. Use the glitter gel pens for the little flowers here. And also, oops. Down here too. And this is a nice relaxing book too. Because this was a um a whip too that I started and I didn't finish um I think I updated this one I colored this one before this was like when did I color this one this was in June and then I decided to um I should have had the before and after picture and then I decided to just add a little more to it I did to add the background to this here make the trees a little darker the apples a little dark a little better yeah, so I updated this one here. And this is a whip. I started this one. Let me take my time. I used, I don't know if you can see the gel pens for the, the water. That was kind of cool. I used the indigo because I barely used the indigo color. And let me see. I started this one. Oh, I know somebody wanted to see me finish this, but I am going to finish this one. I'll finish this next month. I'm going to finish this one. I know somebody said they wanted to see me finish this one. I didn't get a chance to do it. Um, so I'm going to finish that one for next month. So I'm going to keep this book out. So I remember that. I'm going to do that in the Christmas stuff. Um, uh, let me see. Let me see. That's all I did. This is a nice relaxing book though. If you check out the flip through of this book. I started this one and didn't finish. <laughs> Started this one, didn't finish. I'll probably go ahead and finish this off because all I gotta do is color the grass and the flowers, and that's it. And 
and that'll be it. There's some nice relaxing pictures. This is something I do when I'm just relaxing. All right, so that's the stress release book. Let's go to the next one. Oh, I should have did the um. Hold on, let me do the PDFs. It's a uh, uh, um where I started if I forgot and didn't finish it. But um, mm, let me put that over there. So as you know, I did this last month, and I went ahead and finished it. I added this little um star on it. If y'all can see, hold on. And I made the coffee a little glitter. Uh, I like that. I liked it that how I did that. <laughs> She's supposed to be like the colorist, color the fonts. Give her some brown eyes and just did the background. Add some stencils. That's what I get. Um, oops. Let me put this down. I wanted to get some stencils. I can be able to do the background and um that's about it and I did a little pastel in the background just a little bit and finished it off like that I was I didn't know what the color of the sweat I just did a very like it was a black and I just did it real light a color of light to have that gray look like a gray sweater with the pink shirt I should have put some glitter. I mean, glitter right here. I don't know why I didn't do it. Yeah. So I really like this. I really like this bitch. This is the next one. You've probably seen this on my short. Love Glow. This is from. What book is this from? Oh, Timeless Creation Book Quotes to Inspire. So I did this for the hashtag. Was it Color Us You Rock Art? Or. Color and Friends. It was one of them two I did it for. It's a nice easy page to finish. I love doing this orange and yellow red color in the background. I love doing that. It's like a nice fall color. Nice sunset. Because I was just going to leave it yellow and I was like, oh, it's too plain. So I was like, let me put the orange over this color in the back. Mm -hmm. So that came out really, really nice. That's a nice fall picture. I can put this in a frame. And I love the quote, love grows. Next one I did is this one here, a little chibi girl. And this is from, you can check it out on, this is Rose Veil Coloring. And you can check it out on Instagram. I'll put the link in the description. Um, I'll put her Instagram. You can check her out. She's supposed to be coming out with a book. This is a chibi kawaii book. And she gave me a free sample. And you can ask for a free sample. She'll give you a free sample. And I was like, let me just give it this try. It was a lot. This was really, really, really a lot to color. But quite easy, though. So it came out nice. Just kept it simple. Gel pens. I used markers, pencils. I meant to put stars in the back, and I don't know why I didn't do that. I might just add something to the back. Yeah, so this was simple. I really, really like that. I like these. I think the less I color, the better it comes out. <laughs> and here go. Now, this was uh, Questopia. This was a free page. I didn't write on that. <laughs> yeah, I was trying to do the colors here. But um, this was kind of cool. I liked this book here. This is Questopia. I think the Christmas coloring book. Color by number book. And, um... This part was white here, and I just decided to do the gel pen. See that? Put the glitter gel pen. Instead of leaving it white. And I was like, let me, because I was like, I want to color that in. So I was like, let me use the color, the silver gel pen. So that's kind of cool. I think I messed up on one of these things. <laughs> I always mess up on the color by number. Oh, and the, you see the tree? The star, use the glitter. Oh, I should have put the silver in the um. You see where the where the white part was at? Oh, I could have put the silver in it. Hmm, I already did it already. <laughs> oh, I forgot his hat. 
Yeah, so I like this. This is cute. I think I did this for a hashtag. Um, I think the Christmas and July Jolly Christmas. Um, Misty. She has two, no, one tag. One or two, two tags. A color and app tab and a Christmas tag. She has one and I think, um, I forgot somebody else had one. Oh, I forgot. I was supposed to be doing a buddy coloring with um Coffee Lover. Coffee Lover, I'm so sorry, but she's been she was sick though. I didn't even get the chance to color those people have been doing <laughs> buddy coloring. And um I didn't do it because she was sick, so I just kept it to the side. So whenever I guess when we ever we finish finish coloring, I'll put it up. But um I'll get to it. And this is Chibi Girl. This is um by Mary Weed. I forgot to put it on back. Mary Weed. So make sure you check her out on Etsy and on Amazon. I'll put the link in the description. You can check for it. Her books. If you like Chibi books. Chibi. Is it Chibi or Kawaii? It'd be both Chibi or Kawaii. Yes. Yeah, so. I have fun coloring this. <laughs> She has great books, so check them out. Now, the stained glass book. Okay, I will have this finished. This is one of the 10 books I'm supposed to finish. And, um, I know I'll put what I'll be able to finish this this month, but I'll be ready. To, I'll finish this by the end of the year. But I did do a lot of pages. I got, let me see, I think one, two, three, four, five, six pages left. Because I had 10, right? So let me see, what did I do? That's old. That's old. That's old. Oh, this one I did here. I like how this came out because I use gel pens and markers. Regular markers, regular Crayola markers, the board tip markers. And um, some other markers I had. Lowy markers and, cre and cre creative, no, Thomas Creation markers. Only got a few of those left. And I have one, I think, two or three Uhu markers left. So I did that one. I did this one. I for this was a, a whip, and I finally finished it. I should have colored this with the gel pen, the glitter gel pens. So that came out nice. I like the way that came out. Or this one I did here. Did I put the date? I didn't put the date on there. Uh, hold on. I always do that. Ouch. I, oh. <laughs> I don't think I pull a muscle. Okay. Uh, let me put it. 11.22. Yeah, I finished this one up. And this one here. Okay, I got the date for that. Now, for this one, right, I didn't follow the colors. Only some of them. This here, you see this pink here? I put, this is not one here. This is supposed to be number, hold on, 3 and 18. That's supposed to be 3, light brown, and 18, peach. I didn't, I didn't have a peach, and I didn't want to color it with the pencil. I didn't want to use the color pencil. And I decided to put my own colors in. I didn't want the brown. I was like, brown. So I put my own color in. I just colored this all one color, all this one color. And it come out nice. It came out nice. <laughs> I don't know, because the colors was getting kind of weird. It's like, it's too many colors. It was getting kind of weird. But um, it came out all right. It looked all right. I guess it looks. I guess I got to put it in a frame or something. I got to put these in a frame. And I did the fishy. I did a little 
Look, little. See that? Finish this one up. Okay, this one already. Oh, I started this one, but I didn't finish. So I have this one left. I don't think I got tired when I was coloring. <laughs> and this one I did already. So I got this one. This is a lot right here. Oh my gosh. That's too much. I might just put my own colors in this. Um. Oh, somebody had a reverse. If I reverse the colors. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I might do a, a hashtag where you reverse the colors. Like, see, I 21 is black, but I do 21, I put brown, red. I might, I don't know, idea. <laughs> uh, okay, I color that one. So I got this left. This one, butterfly. And this one. And that's it. Yep, 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 yep. So now, I leave the best for last. I did, um, thank you, Rush Me, for the buddy coloring. Um, me and her always do the, um, mandalas together. So, let me show you. I did this one here. I'm surprised I did this one. I was sick when I did this one. <laughs> And it came out nice. I was literally sick when I did this way. And I'm surprised it came out nice like that. And I used this. I had some. I forgot I had some stencil, little stencils that my daughter had. What it came with a set. I was like, you know what? Let me do that and just color it in. And it came out nice. Cause we used four colors for this one. I used the um, castle art and some and markers and gel paints. Next one, I think we just chose any colors for this one. I don't know why that mint green color is so nice. That is so so nice. I like that mint color. That mint. Matter of fact, it look like Christmas colors. I should have. I left this white like this. I didn't know what the color here. I didn't want to mess it up. Hmm. I should have colored that in, but hey, it looks nice. And Christmas colors. I like that green. I think that's pilo green, phyllo green or something like that. I didn't write it down. And the last one, we did a one color. Chose one color for that. So make sure you check out Watch Me. Check out her um, YouTube channel. I just decided to do all red. I don't know why I was doing red for everything. I just, I just said I could do red, green. <laughs> red and green. I might just color everything red and green. So, that is it. Thank you, Rashmi, for doing the body color. <laughs> I got to do some mandalas this month. And the last and least is... The one that took me out. <laughs> you probably didn't see me color for a minute. <laughs> it's the Kirby My Mythomorphia. Okay, I don't know if I'll be able to fit the whole thing in the book. Hold on. Where is it? Come on. Oh, man. Oh. That was, and then you probably saw the picture already. I put it up on my short. And I got to put um, a picture on it too. But, um, or you could check out color. Oh, I did a, but this is a buddy coloring. This was for two things. A buddy coloring with Color Me Inky. I'll put a description in. Hopefully, I don't know if she put hers up, but I'll try to put a picture of hers up on my channel. And this was for the hashtag, um, Kirby Autumn 2022. That's by Happiness Color Kirby, Ro Kirby Rosanis. That's her channel. 
So I'll put her link in the description. She had a um a tag for that. We just color Kirby um pages with autumn colors. So that's what I do. I use red, yellow, orange. Cut this orange and just use either red, yellow, orange, green, brown. So this took a long time, three days. I thought I was never gonna finish this. If I'm going to do two spreads, I ain't coloring nothing else. <laughs> I have to do like, if I do Kirby books, I have to do it like in a, um, like in a month, like take a month and just do Kirby books. But this book is not a book to finish all at one time. It's not like that. It's more like take your time with it because it's so detailed. And it was like so detailed all in the corners and. I was like, oh, no, I wonder when I finish this page. <laughs> uh, okay, the, the little things that I color with the silver, with the um, glitter. The little items you find, the horseshoe and the card. But this came out nice. I did good. It's simple because all I had to do was color. I was like, just color the roses. Color the, the flowers green. I could have did a mythical color, but she said autumn colors. Color the horse a light color, brown, and then... The dark color brown, I the spot here. With the dark color brown there. Let me give it that outline on the horse. His eyes, and that was it. And that was it. I hope y'all can see that. This, this is very big. So thank you, Color Me Inky, Inky, for doing, for the buddy coloring. I'll put her YouTube channel down below, so go check her out. And that's it. So, um, yeah, this is it. So, um, I'm going to put this up today and tomorrow will be the birthday tag. I told you I was going to do the birthday tag for my birthday. It's just simple. It's nothing crazy, you know, just some simple coloring that I put on that stuff that I like. And, um, if you wish to send me something for my birthday, you can check the wish list. You can send me whatever. Um, it's not recommend it if you want to that's on you i appreciate it i really appreciate it but um let me see what else um that's about it i don't know what i'll be coloring for the summer party well christmas pages obviously because <clears throat> i'm doing this channel and my other two i have another channel that i have for a long time and I started posting on that channel. You can check that out too if you want. I just have the little paint by them apps and to put the little designs and stuff on there. And um, also I got relaxing videos on that channel too. I'll put the link in below if you want to check it out. And um, that's about it. Oh, if you know, okay, you got Christmas coming around. So if you want to, you're looking for some gifts for somebody. I do have um. Coloring books on Amazon. I have journals on Amazon. You can check it out. I'll check. You can click the link, the or my link, and you will see it will take you straight to the page. I have um, coloring pages printables on Etsy. You can check that out. And also, if you can check out ArtPal, I have my digital art on there. You can put the art on your on a cup on and you can put it in a frame i think it's cups on a frame, coffee cup frame and you can have the frame in different sizes if you want i have some nice digital artwork on there if you want to check it out so um it'd be gifts as for somebody or for yourself so all the links would be in the description thank you everybody for um watching my channel thank you to all the new subscribers I'm going to try to do some shout outs. Um, probably the next video or so I'll do some shout outs. Or if you check the community tab, if you check my community tab and I'll put shout outs on it. Because sometimes I forget to do the shout outs on my video. Look at the community tab and I'll put shout outs on there. So I want to shout out three people right now. Scully, House of Thriller. Handicapped Traveler, 
T Joe T is it T Joe Creates? Matter of fact, four people. And fix it lady. Um, I wanna thank them because they always comment on my um my videos always and Scully always have some positive words for me. <laughs> you always have me laughing. Um Thank you for commenting on my video. They always comment on my video, even though they, they I guess they learn about the coloring community or whatever like that. So I appreciate that because they didn't have to subscribe to me or whatever. Um, because most of the people that subscribe to me are either is into art or doing coloring or something like that. And these people are like they do other stuff. So they are new to the coloring community, so they wanted to see like what it's about. So Thank you for subscribing to my channel and um, leaving beautiful comments. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it so much. So I'm going to put their links in the description and you can check out their channel if you want to see if you like something else you want that you would like to see. Because I don't just watch coloring channels all day. I watch family channels, point channels and all that. I watch a whole bunch of other stuff. So and I enjoy watching their channels too. So, um, yeah, so shout out to them. And let me see. That's about it. So I'm going to go because I don't want to go over my limit because this thing takes so long to upload. So anyway, check out my chat, my um, video for tomorrow, my birthday tag. If you would like to join, feel free to join. All right. So everybody have a blessed day. Peace, love, and blessings.